hello let's get your computer reset back to when you bought it and or back to a restored save point you might have saved this is great for not only somebody looking to sell their computer but also maybe some of your computers gotten so slow so gummed up this could actually help it uh make it a little faster now before I do this if you do want to go a little faster I might go ahead and uh, try like a CC cleaner or make sure you do a virus and a malware check that could help as well but here we're gonna go ahead and reset for Windows 11 if you have a Windows 10 computer please know that I made a video on that and I'll put a link in the description so if what I just clicked there makes no sense to you and this doesn't look like your your uh, computer then um, you probably have Windows 10 or, or an earlier version of um, Windows. So what I did there was I went to settings. You open up your Windows menu here, there's a settings button. If you can't find it there, you can go ahead and just type it in here, settings, you can go, you can click on it, and that's where I am now. You can see it's a system, the computer I'm on, and if you scroll all, if you keep moving down, down, down the list here, you'll finally see one that says recovery. Go ahead and click on recovery, and then you're going to go ahead and click reset this PC. So go ahead and click that. And now you have two options here. Keep my files, so it'll keep all your personal documents and downloads and things like that, or remove everything, every single thing that um, is on the computer. It's at this point where you click either keep my files or remove everything. If you're selling it, you're going to want to go ahead and hit remove everything. You'll now choose whether you want to do a cloud download or local reinstall. If you don't have it on a USB thumb drive or a CD, you're going to want to do cloud download. Note it is a kind of a big file. And then you want to go ahead and check the additional settings. Everything should be default here, but you can check out the change settings if you'd like. But go ahead and click next. And then ready for you to reset. Just to, you know, this is your warning. You know, everything will be gone after this point. And then you'll go ahead and hit that reset button. And then it should turn into a blue screen like this. And then the device will automatically restart. And you'll be started up on a fresh computer like you opened up a brand new computer from the box asking you for your password and account setup.